happy saturday guys i hope you guys are all are doing well i hope you all are having a great saturday i'm actually um with lonnie and i'm about to go in kirkland's because i have not been here in a while so yeah that's what we're about to go do so come on and let's go oh so um just want to let you guys know i'm doing well i've had a good week look at my baby looking at me look at my, look at my baby looking at me he's so silly <laughs> he's so silly Look how she's still going on here. Okay, so I didn't buy anything in Kirkland's. I just went in there and looked around and then we're gonna go into Tuesday morning. So I'm going to try this spice right here, the Seafood Spectacular. The sodium in it is pretty low, so I'm going to try this, and I'm going to try a couple others. I'm going to try this um, smoked pepper, I'm sorry, smoked paprika, garlic, chili, and chai spice blend, and this has zero sodium. So I'm going to try this. And I'm going to try this roasted garlic and red bell pepper spice blend. And this has <laughs> zero sodium as well. So. Okay, guys, now I'm about to go in Home Goods. I haven't been in Home Goods in a minute. I haven't bought anything really in either of the stores. I didn't buy anything in Kirkland's. And I just bought some spices in, um, what's the name of the store? I bet you she buys what? <laughs> we'll see. Last time we came here, I didn't buy anything, but we'll see. I see no reason why I should ever let you go. Don't wanna wake up if I'm dreaming because you know I can't get enough of this feeling you're giving me. So I'm not really buying any spring stuff because like I told you guys, I'm using the stuff I got last year because it's cute and it's funny. I might buy a few more things to add, but I'm trying to get these rooms done. I ain't thinking about spring right now. So, oh, that's cute. That'll be cute in the backyard. Okay, so we just finished in uh, Home Goods, and believe it or not, I only spent $46. So I've barely bought anything today. I bought some spices and I bought some stuff from um, here because why didn't you know what to do? <laughs> He's so silly. So I'm just gonna, um, cause I told y'all, I'm just trying to get these, these rooms done. So I'm not trying to just rush and be buying stuff. I'm trying to really think about what I purchased. And plus I feel like they, they always have like the same stuff. Like, you um, do. Um, I, I don't know, I just want some unique stuff. So I've been seeing more unique things online. I just am going in these stores now, like these same stores, like Home Goods and those stores, and just seeing like the same thing. And then in Kirkland, seeing like the type, same type of stuff. So I just want like kind of some unique items. Yeah, unique. Tell me you. Of you. Okay. I'm getting some points. That's you already, how you, do you already it. have points. You don't have to try. You don't have to try. Look, you already got me. You don't have to try to impress me anymore. I'm yours. Always try to impress you. Oh, I'm yours. <laughs> so yeah. So now we're gonna go to um TJ Maxx, and then I want to stop at Target. So that's what we're about to go do. And then later tonight we're going to where are we going? Tell me where we're going. We're gonna try to make it to the basketball game tonight. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, you know I'm going to take a nap. I need my nap. So, so yeah. So, we're going to go to the game tonight, and we'll bring y'all with us there. But right now, we're going to head over to, I think it's TJ Maxx. It's either TJ Maxx or Marshalls and Target. And so, that's what we're about to go do. Okay guys, so we are finally back home. It is 2.59. I'm about to eat some lunch because I'm like so hungry. Why do I look like so pale? Um, so let me show you what I got, what I'm gonna eat. Cause we stopped at Chick-fil-A. And I'm gonna show you what I got to eat. And then I'm gonna take a nap because I'm like exhausted. I'm so tired before we go out tonight. So what I got is, let me turn this light on so y'all can see. Hold on, I'm going to turn the camera around, show you what I got. So this is what I got from Chick-fil-A. I got the grilled um, chicken wrap, and I'm only going to eat half of it. And I got the little soup cup, yum yum. And then I got the chili lime vinaigrette. I usually get the avocado, but today I'm going to stick with the vinaigrette dressing. I already started eating. I had half of the um, wrap and half of the fruit, so I have half left over for tomorrow. And if you watch my Insta stories, then you know what pretty much is what's going on. But yeah, so that's it, guys. Okay, you guys, so I am um, done eating. I'm about to go lay down for a little bit, but I wanted to show y'all something because for those of you who follow me on Instagram, you already know that I finally got my new washer and dryer. But for those of you who don't follow me on, on, the, on Instagram and watch my Insta stories, I'm going to show you my new washer and dryer because I absolutely love them both. So I'm going to show y'all. Here we go. So here they are guys. They are May tags and I absolutely love them. We um, decided to go with the risers underneath because I wanted the height of there. But yeah, I'm gonna get some wall decor for here. Probably gonna decorate these shelves. I have, um, I'm still trying to figure out everything that I'm gonna do in here, but I'm gonna be making some changes, not a lot of changes. But I'm gonna have it really cute in here and make it a really nice place where I want to come and do my laundry. I wanna do my laundry now anyway because I love my washing machine and dryer because they work. The, our other dryer worked, it didn't work as good as this one, but these things are like, are like bomb. Like I'm in love. Like I don't even mind washing clothes now. I'm, I, I love how they work. But yeah, so that's our new washer. Those are our new washer and dryer. So now I'm about to go to sleep so I can be nice and refreshed. So when we go to the game later, so I will see y'all uh, when we get ready to leave. So I'll see you later. I hope y'all are having a great day. Comment down below and let me know what you're up to this Saturday because y'all know the deal. It's not all about me. It's about y'all too. And I want to know what you're up to because yeah, I'm nosy. See y'all in a little bit. Okay, you guys, so we are about to um, head out. It is 5.37, the game starts at 7, and I did not get a nap, no, I did not get a nap, but I did lay down, and I got some rest, and um, yeah, so we're about to get ready to go. Um, I'm wearing this sweater, I don't know if you guys can see it, the sweater that I got from Fashion Nova, I'll go in the mirror and show you, but the lighting is bad, and then um, some jeans I got from Fashion Nova, and then some boots that I got from Steve Madden, but let me go over here and show you guys what I have on. All right, so here's what the sweater looks like. And then I have these black uh, jeans from Fashion Nova. And then these little goodies from um, Steve Mann. And in the sweater, let me show you. It opens like this, and I have a little cami underneath it. Yeah, so that's what it looks like. And then, you want to show them what you're wearing? <laughs> Hold on one second. Tell them what you're wearing. Show your outfit. I had on the shirt that she bought me a few years ago. And some nice black jeans and some boots. Yeah. That's what I got. Y'all see he's trying to match <laughs> Okay, Mr. Coat model. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> he's silly. My coat is in my car. Should I take my other coat or should I take my white coat? I'll take my other coat, my plaid coat. Got Charles driving me around after I had to drive all day. So the deal was that I drove today, he drove tonight. That's right. I thought I was going to get a pass, but he was like, you can drive now, you fine. <laughs> isn't, right. isn't that jacked up, y'all? <laughs> <laughs> Just let us keep on 
All right, guys, so we just got here. We're running late, but we're out here in these DC streets, y'all. We out here in these DC streets. I need what this man is riding on. Look, y'all. What's up? Say what's up to the YouTube. Yep. Yep. Right. Right. <laughs> so you guys, I was able to get some healthy food. I was able to get some asparagus, some pesto pasta salad, some um, roasted chicken, and some grain crackers. And look at his plate. <laughs> What'd you say? Reward. This is my reward for the week. Now it's time to go home because it's 10 o'clock. guys so we are back home it is like 10 39 p.m we had such a good time um yeah i'm sleepy uh before i end this vlog i got a piece of friend mail this week so i'm gonna open it and see who it's from so let's do that real quick let me just open it and i'll be right back this is what it looks like and it says as you recover oh it says um this is from Janet Campbell Thomas. So, hey, Janet, thank you. Um, and it says, he sent his words and healed them. Oh, Psalms 107.20. It says, greetings from Tennessee. Hey, Janet in Tennessee. Thank you so much for thinking of me. It says, so glad to see you back and rolling in the streets. Because y'all know I love them streets. <laughs> I have truly enjoyed your videos on YouTube, but most of all, I'm glad that you are feeling better. Please continue to take care of yourself. Hopefully one day we can see you in Nashville. Yes, I do. We do plan to um, visit Nashville. That's on my, um, that's on both of our bucket lists. That's somewhere that we definitely want to visit. So we do plan on um, making a trip to Nashville eventually. I'm not sure when, but that is a destination that we plan to um come visit so yes um she says music city usa yes and home of the tennessee titans oh and then the car says may god's word bring you strength and his presence bring you healing be blessed 
Janet Campbell Thomas. Thank you so much, Janet. This is a lovely card. Let me turn it around. I really, really appreciate you thinking enough of me to send me a card and for your kind words. And yes, like I said, we do eventually plan to um, come to sit Tennessee. There's so many places that I want to go, not just outside of the country, but within the country. So many states that I still want to visit. And I had thought about, um, I was talking to Lonnie about this. I was like, maybe when we go to these different cities, we should plan like meetups or some, something and just say like, we'll be at this place at this time. If you guys want to come through and meet us, then come on through. Um, so yeah, let me know if that would be something that you guys would be interested in because that's definitely something I would be willing to do. Um, but yeah, guys, so that's going to end this video because I'm like super sleepy. Um, this vlog may be a little choppy because I do have to take naps now. Well, I took naps before, but like now, like after I go for a little bit, I get a little bit tired. So I have to lay down and just um, rest my body and recuperate. But I'm doing a lot better. I have my moments and I'm actually... Um, I'm a I've actually started suffering from a bit of anxiety, but that's normal because, you know, now when I feel anything like with my heart or any tingling or anything, you know, you just get a little anxious, like, is what's wrong with me? Is anything going on? But um, I have a good support system. And then plus I have, um, you know, with the cardiac therapy um, rehab, I have somebody that I can talk to and will help me work those issues out if I need to. But yeah, it's... um. Yeah, I'm coming along well, but it is a difficult process. I mean, but I, like I said, I'm just happy to still be here. And you'll probably hear me say that over and over again because I am. I'm just happy to be here. So anything that I do, anywhere that I go, I'm just savoring it. I'm just taking it all in because you just never know. So, um, yeah, but... I'm not trying to depress y'all because this is a happy channel. This is a positive channel, but this is real life. And so, like I said, any things that any any things that I learned, I don't know if I told you guys. No, I didn't tell you guys in this vlog. I did it on my um, story. So let me just backtrack a little bit. For those of you who are not um, aware, I did start cardiac rehab this past Thursday. So it's a 13 week week program, and I started it this past Thursday. And what they do the first time you go, they um. They gave me a stress test because they wanted to see how my heart now reacts when I exercise. Because like I said, you know, back in the day, your girl used to be running six miles a day. I used to be a beast on the Stairmaster. I mean, I used to be in some shape. I mean, last year or so, I ain't been in shape. But yeah, I worked out and everything for years. Every time I go on these places, I always have to hear, oh my God, you're too young. You don't fit the profile. I ain't trying to hear all that because I am the profile now, okay? It is what it is. <laughs> and it just happens that way. You can't beat genetics, so that's that's all that's to it. Yeah, I started Cardiac Rehab. It's a great program. I love my coach. She's awesome. Her name is Kim. She's really great. But yeah, so I'm looking forward to that. They said I can get back in the gym. So um, I, um, I have been walking. Not like walking like I used to walk or anything like that. I won't be running anymore because she told me that I, I don't need to be running. So I won't be running, but I will be walking and I will be starting to do my resistance training again because I'm trying to be summertime fine. You know, I'm trying to be summertime fine. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so... um. Anything that I'm working on or anything that I learn, I'll definitely share it with y'all, you know, because I just want to make sure nobody has to go through what I've been through if it can be prevented. Because if I knew then what I know now, like I said, a lot of it is genetics, but still, you know, it's still a lot of, um, things that I can do so that my heart can start to get stronger. And I know there's a lot of you that have had stents placed in your chest as well, or have had heart issues as well. So whatever I learn, I'm gonna I'm gonna share it and you can take the information and do it with it what you will, or you can just ignore it, but the choice is yours. I'm gonna put the information out here and you know, that's all I can do. But y'all, I'm sleepy and I'm starting to ramble. I hope you guys all had a good Saturday. I had a great Saturday. I'm sleepy now. I'm gonna try to film my um, Magnolia haul tomorrow so I can get that up this week. And um, I know I haven't been putting out as many videos because you know, it can be tiring, especially like last week and I didn't do any, we didn't do anything. We just we just stayed home because I was just, I, I just pretty much stayed in bed all day last weekend. And I will have days like that. I will have weekends like that where I think I'll be able to do something and I just, won't be able to do it. I'll just be too tired. Like this medicine, I have side effects from these medications that they've been giving me and stuff. And you know, so my body's getting acclimated to that. 
and a lot of stuff. Sometimes it makes me dizzy. Sometimes it makes me nauseous. Sometimes it makes me sleepy. You know, it's just a combination of things. Sometimes I feel fine. Like today I felt fine. So today was a great day. But, um, but yeah, in between that, it's a lot. But I'm still on a part-time work schedule, which I love. Like, I don't even know if I want to go back full-time now. And I mean, I just cut my hours down to 32 hours a week. But it definitely has made, like, a significant difference. And one more thing. Um... I, um, I did end up doing the sleep study. I do have sleep apnea. So a couple weeks ago, I got my CPAP machine. And y'all, let me just tell y'all. I thought I got good sleep before I was not getting good sleep. Turns out, you know, I... I I wasn't I was stopped breathing so many times an hour before and that put a lot of stress on my heart before I even had the heart attack so now this CPAP machine just really just helps me helps me breathe during the night I don't wake up gagging gasping for air anymore and I get the best sleep ever I wake up so rested and I'm so rested throughout the day but around like 2 30 or so when I get off work because I work from 8 30 to 2 30 now I'm tired and I'm ready to bring my butt home. But anyway, that's enough talking. That's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you all had a great Saturday. And if you're new to my channel, I just want to say, hey, y'all. Hey, I'm Anita. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the family. I'm so happy to have you. To all my returning subscribers, y'all know I love y'all. Y'all know y'all mean the world to me. And if you happen to be stopping by and you like what you see, feel free to hit that subscribe button down below and become part of the family. But that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. And as always, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Thanks for rolling with your girl. I love y'all. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.